Due to the high toxicity level of the renewed painting of the spacesuit, the probability of your death from radiation is now lower than the probability of death from the suit itself. In this regard, you can fly to the evacuation point. With such an accent, the incorrect localization sounds extremely convincing. The information on the captain's bridge is classified in the database, therefore it is recommended to ignore this value of advice and act according to the situation. badly damaged, but the main systems are still functioning properly. The door is locked. If you manage to get inside, there is a chance to send a distress signal to the nearest planet, or at least take the course with the captain who allowed this to happen. Seems it will be a long day. While choosing the most painless suicide methods for you, a slight decrease in the background radiation was noticed. Surprisingly, your attempt to break the liner could lead to positive results. I could find out the nature of this phenomenon, but for that, I would need to disclose some confidential information of the Breath Edge Company, which contradicts the security protocol, so not a single spacesuit AI will disclose this information to you. On the other hand, this information is extremely necessary for us. There are a lot of stupid spacesuits with dead carriers floating around, so nobody will even know if you resort to the good old torture method like the drill. No, no! I will tell you everything! I swear! Ah, don't do that! What was that? I offered for you to torture other spacesuits! It's a logical thing to do! Well, I won't utter another word. Okay, let bygones be bygones. I suppose you don't think that a program can be afraid of torture, do you? I don't think it can either, and I'm definitely not hinting that you need to find an engineering shuttle. You probably need some explanations which you cannot get because the corresponding dialogues are absent in the game. Therefore, you won't get any. I won't say any more as I can't break the steering protocol. No, seriously, I really can't say anything more! In order to find out how you reduce the radiation, you need to calculate the coordinates of the place where the captain's bridge crashed into the liner. Breath Edge Agency coffins can help us with this. However, we still need to find an engineering shuttle, or even better, the engineer himself. There's an engineering shuttle ahead. I wonder how you find everything so quickly. Is it because of my hints? <laughs> Looks like you escaped with a chainsaw during the crash. I can find no other explanation for such damage to a spacesuit. We need one that is in good condition, or at least other parts of this one. I'd recommend exploring the area.
What's that? Is it the body part I'm thinking of? Oh, nope. It's just a finger. This won't do. This part belongs to the shuttle's owner, or owners. It's hard to tell whether the remains belong to just one person. In any case, this won't do. We need something below the belt, if you know what I mean. All the interior was torn out by depressurization. Looks like there's nothing here. Examine some other debris. What a strange place. But maybe we can find something useful here. <coughs> The durability of the engineering modules is impressive. Even such asteroids couldn't crash them. This is it. I wasn't sure if the engineer's legs remained intact, but we were lucky. Unfortunately, due to the security protocol, I cannot tell you that the special magnets built into his engineering boots can be used to illegally open the back panel of Breath Edge coffins. <laughs> You probably need some explanation about this. I have no right to inform you that Breath Edge Agency coffins exchange information with each other concerning obstacles flying by in order to avoid collisions in space. Collecting this information would help determine the trajectory of the captain's bridge, which in turn will determine the coordinates of its collision with the liner. Not the most useful instrument in space. A witty toy with a non-witty name. The developers are clearly 13 years old. I'm better than any new spacesuit. I recommend just upgrading the current equipment. For example, paint the helmet. I'm sure it will help. radiation level is much lower. That's great. I'll give you directions. Fly to the left. Or to be more precise, to the right. 
your other right, which is at the top. Okay, that was a bad idea. Marking corresponds to the water tanks. The marking corresponds to the water tanks. Part of the Breath Edge storage. There are only some empty coffins here. You can even choose one for yourself if you want to. This is a non-standard modification. Looks like somebody probably wanted to improve the speed characteristics of this coffin, which is a direct violation of the contract, although the idea is implemented quite well. Such supplies of electrical tape suggest that engineers doubted the durability of the liner. <laughs> Judging by the steady melting of the rolls, there was a fire in the engineering modules, but it definitely was not the cause of the disaster. Some more evidence of the fire in the modules. Apparently, the fire had spread even to the habitation modules.
Unfortunately, this awesome remedy does not cure breaches or depressurization. A dangerous predator, although in this case the predator just stuck to the floating remains.